What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I'll be bringing you guys another how-to video. You guys seem to like those. Uh, this one, uh, I'm going to be showing you guys how to install a front brace uh, on my 2005 STI. Now this installation can vary from uh, Subaru to the front brace you get, uh, but in general it should be about the same and I'm going to show you guys how I'm going to be installing this one. So let's get into the video. All right, so this is what my front brace looks like right here. Uh, that's what I'll be installing. And one thing you guys are going to need is some a little tool like this to take clips off because uh, every bumper is like held on by clips. And something like this just makes taking the clips out a lot easier because we're going to have to take the front bumper off. Uh, I also got a uh, screwdriver because my fender liner is... Uh, uh, held on to my lip uh, and I just need a screwdriver to get that out and I got my trusty water here because it's super hot out uh, right now I'm just in my garage but yeah this is what the front brace looks like all right so first things first we're gonna have to take off the whole front bumper and the front bumper is just held on by some clips uh, here at the top uh, take the grill off you're gonna have some more clips under there uh, you're gonna have two little clips right there as well. And then I gotta go over to the side here and take off the clips from the spats here. Uh, and of course I gotta get the fender liner that's attached underneath uh, to my front lip. I just gotta unscrew that. And then after that, you basically you can just like pull the bumper off. It's gonna have be attached with like sliding clips in there. So once we do that, we can easily pull it off. So with all the screws and little plugs out, uh, it should just come out uh, pretty easy now. So I'm gonna start with this side, uh, the driver's side, and I'm just gonna pull on right here uh, and uh, get this side out first. And then I'll go over to the passenger side and then pull right here and try to get this side out and then take the whole thing off. And just like that, boys and girls, we got the bumper off and it's right here. Uh, now, did wanna tell you guys something. I had a screw running from here up into the uh, fender right here, up in there holding it so uh, whoever had this car before me probably did that right there and on this side as well so if you guys can't get your bumper off maybe it's not coming off on those sides check if you've got a screw running uh, from there uh, up into the fender but yeah now with the uh, front bumper off um, I believe we're gonna have to take the front brace off here uh, I'm gonna try to squeeze maybe try to squeeze the uh, brace uh, underneath here underneath this front uh, support here I'm gonna try to squeeze it under there uh, if I can't I'm gonna take this off and it's pretty simple it looks like just got some screws here here and uh, over there and same thing with this other side uh, it's going to be some screws just holding it on uh, there. And then I think after that, we'll be able to pop it off. But let me check first to see if I can get it underneath here and align properly. If I can, then I'm not going to take this off. All right, so I was actually able to do it without taking this uh, front support off. And I'll show you guys where I mounted it. So it's going to be these two top ones. I had to take off my Hellhorns uh, bracket here, but I'll put it back on. Uh, but yeah, it goes onto these guys here. And then if you look under, goes right there. And then the same thing for that side as well. Actually, it looks pretty sweet. I like it. Yeah, so that is how it's mounted right there. After messing with this thing for quite a bit, I finally got the bracket back on and the hella horns uh, able to fit. Actually, still had those little 
adapters uh, back there that extend the hella horns and now I just use those with some screws uh, put all the wiring back and uh, now it's time to put the bumper back on so uh, the way to do that is just carefully uh, put it on the center uh, snap the sides back in and then pop all the little plugs that go in here and in there back in should be pretty simple so I'm gonna do that real quick all right she's put all back together and dang that front brace looks freaking good uh, one thing I was struggling with I didn't put it on camera I'm not gonna show you guys but I took the bumper on and off like four times because this front brace I was installing got in the way uh, right here uh, so I had to just keep keep cutting uh, part of this out right there I don't know if you guys can really see but yeah uh, I'm not gonna put that on camera but if it's happening to you guys uh, you might want to cut that part of the bumper uh, right there but other than that uh, pretty easy install uh, for you guys all right and that is how you install a front brace if you guys found this video helpful make sure to click that like button for your boy now uh if you've got any questions or comments leave them down below and if you want to see more videos like this make sure to su uh, subscribe uh, i'm going to be coming out with uh some more videos because i just bought like 2500 dollars worth of parts I'm trying to build this subaru up to be about like 350 uh, to the wheels on a stock block still uh, trying to keep it reliable uh, but anyway thank you guys so much for watching i'll catch you guys in the next one peace